hey guys what is up and welcome back to a new vlog my name is onyeka for those of you who are new to my channel and if you are an og on this channel thank you so much for stopping by once again so today i decided to do an intro on this vlog because for the longest time i haven't done an intro on my vlog so i'm gonna grace you guys with my face today <laughs> um if you haven't yet subscribed please now would be a good time to subscribe to my channel make sure you click on the subscribe button down below and make sure you turn on that bell notification button. So the real reason why you guys are seeing my face at the beginning of this vlog, um, this is future me, by the way. This is future me. You know me, I'm always want to put you on, always want to tell you guys about the good stuff that's happening. So when it comes to sending money internationally, this is something I tend to do quite often. And trust me guys, it hasn't been an easy process. Um, I recall last year when I was getting married, um, I made a lot of international transactions because my wedding was in Nigeria, so I was planning my wedding from here. So um was sending um a lot of nigerian vendors money from here and trust me guys that process was such a nightmare and ever since then i've been struggling to find safe ways to send in money internationally in a timely manner so which brings me to the sponsors of today's video so thank you western union for sponsoring today's video and by now i'm sure you guys all know who western union or what western union is western union is not going to be a stranger to you at this point you must have probably heard them or even used your services so western union has been a reliable name for over 160 years and their global network spans across 200 countries and since i started using western union i have been able to send my money safely quickly and easily to my friends and loved ones abroad and some of the other reasons why i tend to send money abroad to name a few would be like for investment purposes in nigeria um also to help out a friend pay um like international tuitions overseas or even just to buy some luxury items in europe where they tend to charge in us dollars so i tend to send my personal shopper um money internationally as well and guys of course you you know you know there's always that family member that never stops asking you for money and for me it's my younger brother guys you, you know how they are so i'm not go even gonna go into that much details and when it comes to sending money i don't joke with my heart and money because i also want to ensure that whatever means i'm using to send money is going to be safe and secure it's also my mom's birthday in a few months she's turning 55 so i'm going to send her some money and i'm going to be using my western union app to do this because it's also going to be very easy for her to receive it and also as a new customer you can send money online for a zero dollar transfer fee you don't don't have to worry about those crazy transfer fees as a new customer so i don't know what you're waiting for guys so please download the western union app today right now from your apple store or from your play store if you're using android and guys did i mention how convenient it is and after you create an account you can start sending money right away and your receiver gets your money within minutes again i'm not sure what you're waiting for please hurry up and download the western union app today from your app store or your play store and start sending money online the smart way i don't know about you but i'm going to be sending money using western union from now on it's such a hassle free experience and such a convenient way that fits just right into my day i don't have to be worrying about the safety and security of my bank accounts because western union is very secure and very safe to use so download the western union app today and start sending money online the smart way so guys i hope you do enjoy this vlog um i put in a lot of time and effort editing this video so please do not forget to engage in my videos click on all the links you can click and like and share this video guys i will see you guys later bye hi guys so last time my vlog was on sunday today is tuesday today is the 25th of july guys my birthday is tomorrow anyways i'm going to toronto for two days and i'm staying at my sister's uh what else so tomorrow for my birthday i'm just gonna have like a brief intimate birthday dinner like initially i didn't plan to do anything but my husband and i are just going to toronto so we're like let's just do something rather than just staying inside so i was like okay um i booked um a reservation for about six people and that's what's just gonna be anyways i'm heading out now it's almost six and yeah i'm wearing my mexico shirt again this i'm wearing a lot of skulls and this is my bag is this a tote bag i don't know this is from mexico again of course skulls i don't know why they like skulls but yeah so I will see you guys later. Bye. Hi guys. It's my birthday today. It's my birthday. I was going to say it's my birthday morning, but no guys, it's almost 3 p.m. And this is the first time I'm actually picking up my camera 
well to be fair i slept till like 11 and then it's just been one phone call after the other ever since and i look so crusty right now but don't worry, i'll look very cute soon because i'm about to go and take a shower and look nice let me cover my face so <laughs> Anyways, it's my birthday and I'm happy. It's my 29th birthday. Let me not lie, I'm tired. Like I've been, I just feel like turning my phone off. Like the notifications are giving me so much anxiety, and it's been stressing me out. That, that's how I feel. Let me not lie, but I'm, I'm happy. Like I've been getting a lot of prayers and well wishes and everything. But yeah, it's been real good. It's been real good. And I've also been getting some comments from you guys because I put out a birthday post on my community. So thank you guys for all of the birthday wishes and I really do appreciate every one of you all the time you've taken to watch my video, engage in it or just being there. Yeah, I really really appreciate you guys and yeah. So the plan for tonight is to have like a mini birthday dinner. We're just gonna be six in number and that's it, so it's not anything major. I booked a restaurant downtown in Toronto, I'm in Toronto by the way. I arrived last night and I just chilled with my husband and sister and that's it. Anyways, um, yeah, like I said, I'll just go and shower and get ready. So I want to get ready in such a way that my reservation is for 7.30 and it's currently like 3.30ish. I want to start getting ready so I can take my precious time to get ready and take some pictures and not even have to rush because I hate rushing. But yeah, so let me go and get to that. I'll see you guys soon. Dropping. Smoke way too much. I keep coughing. I pull at all the stops to make a profit. When I get hey guys, so I am ready. or well, partially ready. I haven't put on my shoes or carry my pack yet, but my dress is ready. So I will show you guys a full view in a bigger mirror. But this is what we're looking like. Make sure you see my eyes. So, so for my hair, I attached a ponytail and made my sister weave it for me. It came out nice. I've had, I've done this before, but it worked. It worked out well before. But I used only one pony. But this one, I doubled the pony. I don't know how to explain it, but I will explain it later. But right now, I'm in such a hurry to explain. But yes, I think I look cute. I'll do a full view for you guys. But let me take some pictures. My mind be my clonopin. Let me chug this thing and be proud of it. I will carve it in and I'll make you feel like you on the cloud and you can't sit still when we on the floor and I'm on the force and you use the force. There's no problem. I will carve it in and I'll make you feel like you on the cloud and you can't sit still when we on the floor and I'm on the force and you use the force. There's no problem. When I'm with you, I'm holier than Jesus. Religious freedom, paid leave to get on my knees and pray to you if you're cool with cosplay and teacher. I don't mean to come across facetious, but it's all a joke to me and it should be to all of these. Sometimes I think it's the only way to stay decent. When the wind blowing that way, we ought to pray the breezes. I will carve it in and I'll make you feel like you're on the cloud and you can't sit still when we on the floor and I'm on the force. Past couple of days i don't know i haven't vlogged i've just been living in the moment anyways the dinner went well it was fun like everyone had a good time uh i was expecting six people but we ended up being five but yeah it's all good someone couldn't make it um i'm about to leave right now it's currently almost 5 p.m i slept all day and what else just chilled and because right now i'm also like having time off from work but who knows something may come up and i might just pick something up but yeah so we're about to head back to london um so it's gonna be me my husband and grace i don't know if i've introduced grace to this channel i met her like last up on monday we went out for lunch uh yeah we also had dinner yesterday went to the beach as well blah 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 anyway so i'm about to head back to london i feel like 
I want to get back to, into my old routine again and I have a couple of things pending that I need to sort out back home so yeah hope you guys have been enjoying this vlog so far uh, I know I'm not the most interesting person but still thank you guys for watching and please do not forget to like share and subscribe to my channel okay and I will see you guys soon I also forgot to um, explain the ponytail I had yesterday because it was sort of like the synthetic um, extensions that you can braid. I've used it, I used it sometime in December last year, but when I braided it on my hair, it was too thin, so I bought another one. And then one time I tried to do it myself, and it was a total disaster. I guess it was too bulky for me, and then I don't have eyes at the back of my head. Oh, and what else? So I had my sister do it for me yesterday and it was perfect. Like that was the look I was trying to go for. And yeah. So if you're if you want to get something like that, just let me know. I can leave the link in the description box. I think I'll just leave it eventually because somebody will ask. So I'll just leave the link. So check uh, my description box for a link to get like do synthetic braiding hair. And yeah, bye for real this time. Bye. Say something that will make my day. Good morning guys. I haven't spoken to you guys in like two days. Yes, so last time we talked was on Sunday, I think. I'm not sure. But yeah, so today is Tuesday, August 1st. Happy new month, guys. I don't know when this vlog will be going out, but sometime in August. But I'm heading out to do my hair. So last night I washed my hair. So yes, it was such a busy day for me. Anyways, I washed my hair and did some cooking and everything yes it was such a productive day don't worry i'll share the good news with you guys very soon um yeah so i'm heading out to do my hair right now uh i'm gonna be doing half conros half braids and i just ordered my uber i don't want to drive there because that part of town is sketchy so i'm not driving and um, anyway so just casually dressed very comfortable i haven't worn my crocs yet but i'm rocking this my back from mexico once again i love it so much it's so comfy and this shirt, I literally stole this shirt from my husband a couple of years ago and I haven't worn it ever since. I don't even know why I stole it, but I like it. Anyways, hope you guys are doing good and I will take you guys along as per usual. You're haunting me so I can't sleep She was a pretty little liar who cut me deep Cause she left me here alone
Hi guys. Oh, I just hope I can get my phone to stand or let me increase my seat. Yeah. So I'm on my way home. We just stopped to get something. And by we I mean my husband and I, he just stopped to buy something. I, I'm waiting in the car, so this is my hair. You guys are the ones taking a first look. I haven't like officially officially seen it. But yeah. So I can't wait to get home, take a shower and you know have some fresh face. You know, looking at the hair, looking all cute. My face looking like I had a face lift. Anyways, I think I like the hair already. I haven't even gone home, but I think I like what I see. Uh -huh. So back to what I was saying. Um so tomorrow I have a massage appointment and afterwards I have a nail appointment. So this, this vlog is gonna be like a pamper pamper vlog, like a reset pamper. I don't know how did that people call that vlog, please. <laughs> Let me actually think of it. It's like a self-care vlog. Yeah, so I'm pampering myself. So I'm pampering myself, I'm treating myself nice for all the hard work that I go through, okay? Yeah, like I go through a lot. <laughs> It's not easy <laughs> but yeah so tomorrow is self-care day so today was a kind of like self-care day but tomorrow is like the one i'm looking forward to like i'm looking forward to my massage appointments and then i get i'm getting my nails done so for my nails so for like the longest time i've been thinking of how to transition out of acrylics i really want to just rip it off my nails and you know just do maybe nail polish on my natural nail because i know my nail is going to be sensitive to temperature i'm sure you know what i mean if you usually fix artificial nail well not like my nails are artificial because it's all my nails that's underneath it's just the acrylic powder like i really don't want to be using the uv light for now i just want to transition out of it just for now so tomorrow i'll be trying dipping powder like uh, that's the thing that's been on my list but let's see how it goes tomorrow so dipping powder mm -hmm. i hope you're worth it though it's cheaper than acrylic nails so um excited and i also caught myself yesterday i was deboning fish and it was so dry and it the bone pierced my hand and it hurts so much today afterwards after tomorrow i have the day off nothing well i have the days off so when i say I have the day off i mean there's nothing scheduled then on friday i have a dental appointment i haven't been to the dentist since like june of, or july last year and that's like a year i should have been going like every six months but well so yeah um i probably won't talk about it tomorrow morning when i'm going so i've just said it now so when you see me going out tomorrow morning you know that's where i'm going to all right guys bye send me off with the words of a lullaby guys i just finished my massage session and uh, it was it was it was everything and more like you know how you feel after a massage session that's exactly how i feel i feel so relaxed i feel so refreshed like i'm heading home to take a nap like that's it it's still early in the day it's still 12 30 because my permanent is for 11 30 so it's 12 37 so I'm just going home to take a nap and then I have my nail appointment at 3. I'm feeling good, feeling relaxed, you know, hair is laid. My hair reminds me of my secondary school, by the way. Hair is laid, body is, you know, soft and relaxed. So my nail is up next and I still have a bunch of clothes in my closet that I still need to arrange. I've been putting it off for like two weeks now. So, all right, guys, I will see you pretty soon. Hey guys, um, it's been two hours later and I'm heading off my nail appointment and I just decided to rock this dress again. If you guys recall, I wore this dress sometime in June to like a African picnic, I mean an African picnic thingy. 
and I was like, ah, before the summer ends, I want to rock this dress one more time because I love how simple it was. It's a little rumpled, but it's chiffon, and I think I look cute in it. And yeah, guys, I also napped after um, the massage because it was needed. Like, it was needed. Anyways, let me get going right now. The weather is amazing outside today. It's not too sunny, it's just windy. And yeah, and for my dress, you guessed it, it's from <laughs> ASOS. And this purse was a gift and it's Steve Madden. I think he has Steve Madden. Anyways, let's go. Of a lullaby. Send me off with the words of a lullaby. 